Mr. Navani, what has changed about the dress code? Well, the, ma the main change is um, students can wear hats. Um, you know, that, that was something that has been very popular. Um, it was kind of a battle that the past several years administrators have fought because it was a part of our school dress code, yet, you know, kids like their hats, whether they were beanies, they went style, baseball caps. So the school board looked at it and, and uh, accepted the change. That's the most significant change. Other than that, I think um, most of it's the same, you know, about, you know, wearing proper clothing, cannot have anything that's um, derogatory, you know, towards, you know, race or um, sex or, you know, drugs or alcohol. So a lot of it's the same, but the biggest change is the wearing of hats. You still need to show the face. I mean, a lot of times, and that's a safety issue, we have to be able to identify kids, you know, if we have a fire drill. But a, a hat, as long as um, we can still identify the student, is okay. But it's, uh, besides the dress code, what else has changed? School rule-wise, you know, um, we're going to, we went to four lunches, you know, before AL had COVID, we had three lunches. Then with COVID trying to spread all these kids out, we went to six lunches. Um, what we found out maybe through the COVID experience is that having four lunches by grade level was something we could do. Um, it's working out pretty well for us. So um, the lunches are pretty good sized um, and, you know, sitting with their own grade, I think kids are appreciating that.